Okay, Wooshy Tony update 379 taken on, oh god, what day is it? It's August 10th, 2009. Can you see the rain on the windows? Anyway, there we go. It's raining out. It's Monday, which is my Friday, because Tuesday and Wednesday are my days off. There's my ironing board. Now, there's Tony. Tony, this is one of his fetishes. He loves to play with this fan. This is an old fan, I guess. It's had it for about five years. It finally bit the dust. Uh, Tony, Tony, come here. Come here, buddy. You gotta follow me. Come on. That's it. Oh, good boy. Now, show all the uh, people who like watching you what you can do with this thing. Tony, come on. Come on. Tony, that's a purse, you don't need that. Can't oh, Tony, ah, uh, just, just goes to show you, you know. He'd been playing on this thing for five minutes, and of course in that time it took me, you know, took me a bit of time to decide, you know, hey, I should take a video of this and put it on Wooshy Tony Update, but, uh, and of course he's not playing with it now. That's just the thing with children. The things they do off camera are just seven times more amazing than the things they will do on camera. And if you can't catch them doing amazing things, well, it's a bonus. It's a bonus. Anyway, oh yeah, there's the box that uh, yeah. Fritz from Tucson, Arizona bought us. Thank you. And this is this is a thing uh, for Tony. Now, uh, we... What, oh, what's the matter? What's the matter? What's the matter? Okay, Tony. Okay, look out. Okay, Tony. I'll release him. Release the house! Very good. Now, what... I don't know. This is a game, but we discovered that because Tony likes things like coins, he loves to put them... Well, slide them in the slot. Come on, Tony. Make sure it's locked again. All right. Do it. Put her in. What are you doing, Tony? Ah, uh, again. He's just not going with the program. He's not following the script. Well, what can you do? All right, Tony. Put it in. Put it in and do it properly this time. Yeah, very good. He did it properly. Good stuff. Hi. As you can see. This is, uh, if you remember the video we took where we went to Masa's Kitchen in downtown Wuxi, we came across one of these little games, and of course my, one, my wife bought it at the uh, wholesale market, and of course Tony's enjoying it, very much so. Now, what else is happening? Put everything in an historical context. What did happen? What ha what's happened recently? Uh, we think that John Hughes guy. He's a director of films and things like uh, movies like Pretty in Pink. He died, and I actually went on the uh, com and uh, watched some of his movies. He's dated, okay. As Sir Kenneth, Sir Kenneth Clark said, movies are basically very ephemeral forms of entertainment. Um, hard to think of anything that stays classic for a while. Except maybe some Fred Astaire stuff. Uh, of course, the, I'm reading about those meetings in America over the Obamacare. It's kind of good to see that they're, they're fighting back against that sort of stuff. Excellent. Well, hopefully they, the opponents do put a stop to this. Um, yes, all right. And that's about it. It's, it's August 10th, 2008. Remember, it was about a year ago that uh, China had the Olympics. It was, I remember, yeah, watching the opening ceremonies. After that, well, you know, we uh, yeah, followed them sort of briefly. But uh, the question I'm going to maybe ask the students now is, it's been a year since the Olympics, and have there been any benefits from them? Uh, for Wuxi, I don't know. I really don't see any. Uh, as I say, I think it's these things are just big parties paid for by the government, and like every party, maybe it might have memories, but as far as sort of economic uh, benefits, per permanent economic benefits, I see none. I see none. You know, you 
You could have devoted your resources to a party. You could have devoted your time to to building something, to adding economic value. But uh, like you say, preparing preparing for it, you could say that the infrastructure gave economic value. But somehow, I doubt it. I think it was more about the party and showing off and the actual uh, economic benefits, permanent economic benefits, just they never really manifest themselves. Anyway, pardon my uh, my screed there. Anyway, I'll sh I should leave it at that. You know, the longer I talk, the harder it is to upload these things to uh, to YouTube and YouTube. Anyway, thank you for watching. Wushi Tony Update 279, taken, taken on August 10th, 2008. And at least I'll end it by focusing on Tony. Tony, say bye bye. Very good. Say again, bye bye. Bye bye. Ah, I should have ended it the first time. Nothing ever goes according to script. Oh, yeah. That bruise, that's the bruise I was mentioning that he got at KFC. He did a face plant, but he'll survive.